Hey guys, long time no see. So, I know I have a lot to catch you up on, but um, I just wanted to bring out the camera really quick because we are changing up the living room and we're saying bye to our old table. So, this is it. Um, I don't know if I've made a video since like us really being married and like showing our house and stuff like that. I don't think I have, but this is our old table. Thank you, Lori and Parker, for gifting this to us. But unfortunately, it just doesn't really fit um, like the kind of vibe that I'm going for and um, the size of this room. I feel like I just need something a little bit smaller to make this room feel bigger because this room is pretty small. This is our new table. It's from Target, and I'll show you guys um, once we start putting it together and all that good stuff. But um, I'll also ins insert an old picture of what this room looked like so that you guys can have a pretty good idea. But basically, this um, light fixture used to be silver, and I spray painted it black. I'm going to put curtains up there. That curtain rod is from Walmart, actually, a really good price. And I painted this whole room white before it was this, like, grayish color. Um, then that wall was black, and then I just painted the whole thing white. So, yeah, I will, um, show you guys our whole process. I'm still waiting on the curtains to come in. Um, so, we're gonna, we're gonna just get this space figured out. But, in other news, <laughs> this is my baby. He's so handsome. His name is Hendrix. He is almost three months old, and he is amazing. We love him, obviously, so, 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 so much. We'll talk more about, um, like, my pregnancy, my um, uh, birth story, all of that stuff in another video. Um, but, yeah, so let's get into the makeover. Afterwards, we went to Dirt Cheap. We um, were looking for a sideboard slash buffet table cabinet for um, this side of the dining room. I want to be able to store some stuff because we don't have a lot of storage in this house. And I also kind of wanted to do a little coffee bar. I'm not 100% sure. I haven't gone to a coffee bar there yet because I don't know if I want it to just look 
like aesthetic and nice if I want it to be functional like on the top part. Obviously on the bottom part I'm gonna store stuff but I'm still kind of working through that so I'll kind of style it, figure out what I want to do. But we found a cabinet. Um, I can link the original for you guys if you want the original but we got it for dirt cheap for a fraction of the price. So that's really exciting. It's always exciting when you can find a discount. But we are going to put this together. I'm going to style it, kind of figure out what the plan is, and then I'll show you guys how it all turns out. So we ran into a little bit of an issue. We opened the box and there are like, there's no hardware. Absolutely none, no screws, no nothing. So, but luckily we have the instruction manual. And so I went on the website and I was able to order the hardware and it was free to order the uh, full hardware pack. So that's great. It'll be here in a week. By then our curtains will be here as well. So hopefully we can kind of finish up this video, but that is, is also one thing with buying from dirt cheap if any of you guys have a dirt cheap near you um you know you can't do returns or exchanges so it is kind of like a gambling game when you're buying from them um we checked though and all of the actual pieces are here so we didn't have to order like any actual pieces to build it other than the hardware so that's frustrating, but it'll be here in about a week. I can get everything finished and set up then. So I will update you guys when that stuff comes in. Okay, so my camera's dying. I forgot to put on the charger, but um, I found this piece of canvas art from the Salvation Army for $7.99. And I'm going to redo it so I can put it in our living room. Um, I'll sh pop up, try to show like an inspiration picture if I can. Um, I've already started on it, just kind of get like a feel for what I'm doing. Basically, I'm mixing plaster of Paris with water and like getting it to that, like the correct consistency. And I'm mixing it with paint. So, um, I'll show you guys what I have so far. So this is it. Um, I've already started to pour out some of the mixture. You gotta work really fast with this. Um, so I'll, you know, show you guys in a second, but I'm basically just doing just the first layer and then I'll go back in um, and kind of like bulk up the texture a little bit. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay guys, so um, today the curtains came in, the hardware pack for the um, cabinet came in, and the rug. So I figured I would go ahead and try to put the cabinet together and maybe um, put the what is this? The curtains up so that this room can be finished. Oh, and this is, um, there's the artwork that I finished. Um, so I can hang that at some point tonight, most likely tomorrow. So anyways, I will just do a time lapse of me putting the cabinet together and I read the reviews and it said it's probably gonna take like an hour so let's just get started <laughs> Okay guys, so we finished the cabinet super late last night. I don't think we got done until like um, 11.30. I think we started around 10, so it took us about an hour and a half. Um, but I really love how it turned out. So it's got this like herringbone kind of um, look to it. It's really nice, really sturdy. Um, and we love it. So I'm going to link the exact one um, in the description for you guys if you want to buy this. Um, you know, we got it at a discount store, but I'll link it for you guys. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and hang the curtains. Um, and I guess I'll go ahead and put the rug down while we're here. And... I might need your help, babe, to hang the, um, to hang the painting. Okay. How are you going to do the painting? I figured we'd just measure, like, the middle of the wall, and then we can probably do, like, an anchor. I'm going to show you the back of it so you can see, like, what. Yeah. I'm going to need to know this, dude. Hey, little man, hey, little man, hey, hey, little man, hey, little man, hey, hey, little man, hey, little man, hey. regular nail? Well, no, we hit it. Well, an anchor and a screw, yeah. Yeah. The nail doesn't matter. Yeah, okay. Okay. We just gotta make sure we do it the right way. Yeah. Okay, so I got these curtains from Amazon. I originally got some from Walmart. Or, Walmart? Target. No, Walmart. And... They were too short, so I returned them. And then I got some from Target without realizing that Target sells you one panel per pack. And they were like $30. So I just returned that and just ordered these from Amazon. Um, they feel really nice though. They're just plain white curtains. 
and I had to get the 96 inch because I hung the curtain rod a lot higher than the window to make the room feel bigger. Well, you want the feet to be what's yeah. lined up, yeah. So we could have the wood grain going this way, or we could spin it to where it's going this way. What would you prefer? Because it doesn't really matter that much, huh? It doesn't matter. Okay. It's just a technical thing. Yeah. Okay. All right, and the gels. Le gels. I love it. Do you? Good. Yeah, it looks really good. It looks a lot better. And there's plenty of space, too, like, still. Yeah. Even with the, the coffee thing here. Yeah. And you're going to keep it as a little coffee station? Uh, so you move the drawer up. Mm-hmm. And I move this one down. That's cool. So you have glasses and then big stuff. Yeah. And we can fit, I mean, if we have that's another smart. little, like, smaller appliance that we need to put down there, we yeah. can, but... Yeah, that's smart. Oh. There you go. I mean, I could have done it, but I didn't want his wheel. I love it. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys, so I just got back from um, TJ Maxx. I got a couple of little decor items. So to start off, I got this. Um, I don't know. I just thought it was cute, and I liked that this was, like, concrete just to give it some different color and texture in here. Um, so I put that over there, I like how that looks. And then I got this little like pedestal kind of thing. Um, 
I got this with the intent to spray paint it. Um, again, just to add just a tiny bit of height. And then I figured I'd put a candle. I got this candle. This is um, from California Harvest. Pumpkin and Chai. It is a soy candle, which I tend to um, go for. And, oh my God, it smells so good. So, yeah, I think, I think I'm going to spray paint this because it really is just too much wood. Yeah, definitely got to spray paint it. So, um, I also got a couple of other things that I'll just show you really quick after I get this freaking sticker off of here. I hate how they put the sticker like on the actual like item, like where people could see it, like put it on the bottom and then I don't have to worry about scraping this thing off. Okay, anyways, so our friends have been stuck in the hospital. Um, for like 10 days because their baby ended up getting an infection. Anyways, they're coming home today and I found this cutie little outfit. I made her a basket. Um, so I'm going to put this in the basket. Anyways, I also just got some like loungewear kind of things. These are just some basic like cropped little t-shirts. And then these are actually men's, but I'm really into like the long, like basketball short, like loungewear kind of stuff. So I got that. But anyways, I have these books here because I didn't know if I wanted to add them somewhere. Maybe like here just to raise that up a little bit maybe. Got her. <laughs> Here. I don't know. Uh, we'll leave that for now, I think. Okay. Let me spray paint this. Okay, so these are the shorts. <laughs> just a quick outfit change in the middle of the video, but, and this is the shirt. I just tucked it underneath my, um, my bra and I think it's really cute this has like been like my vibe lately just like casual loungewear that's cute anyways so I spray painted this and I think it looks so much better black and also just adds some contrast to this like whole setup over here and then the candle love that and I think this room is done, maybe. So let's show you guys. for watching and following along if you want to see more videos like this be sure to subscribe I'm definitely gonna to try to post more often but um, I love you guys and I will see you in the next one bye